Hello Internet, this is Truly Daybok, and right now we are doing a reaction, or our thoughts of KCON Day 1. Uh, this will be part 3 of the regular podcast, but uh, the plan is we're going to put this up the night of, or the which it's already 1 in the morning, but we're going to try to get our thoughts out on what our, how our day was, what we thought of the concert, and there's a lot to say, definitely. I have the uh, usual cast of characters, They're, the information is somewhere like on this side uh so yeah um i guess i just want to start it off with like the convention part like how was everyone's day like what'd you guys do i mean we were all together so i know but like what'd you guys do what'd you guys see i know Paige has a lot to say about a lot of people who are soft so i'll let her go first mm, like first i don't know so what do we want to, like just like everything that i did yeah what'd you do um, okay, well, here we go. Um, <laughs> I got here, I got there, I got here, I got there at 10.30? No. 10. 9.30. 9.30. 9.30. And got in line for Stray Kids High Touch, which was at 11 something. I don't, my brain isn't functioning. And basically, I did the High Touch. I told Chan that I'm proud of him and everything he's done for his team. I told... Ji Sung and Sung Min, they're my favorites. I told Hyunjin he was beautiful, and I complimented Felix's freckles. He has freckles? Oh no. Don't ask questions. I'm oh, oh, sorry. No, I, no, no, this going, is a keep big going, thing. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Anyways, after I did that, because apparently other people did that, he wiped off his foundation like really aggressively. Like, for Why? The because so they can see, they his can see his freckles. Oh. Yeah, because, because he apologized for them a while ago. So. He, um, that happened, and then I got a few people looking at me in that video and doing direct interactions, and then I got done with that, and then I went to my sister, who was going to be in the Pentagon line after Hayes, and we kind of just followed the Hayes high touch line, and then I told people in that line to compliment her and, like, tell her she's beautiful and to compliment her Olaf, and then suddenly someone, like, looked at me, and they're like, do you want to do it? <laughs> just like, tell her yourself. I'm like, wait, what? And she, like, I'll give you a high touch for free. I'm like, are you serious? I last minute I got into Hayes high touch and I managed to tell her that she was beautiful and she's she was really 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 soft about it. So that happened last minute, and then I had to line up for red carpet because Aubrey had the Pentagon high touch. That was for like three hours or whatever, and then. I got into red carpet. We got to the end of the, like, near the corner where they're going to be walking, where they were walking in, and we were basically front row, kind of, yeah. So I got a lot of artist interactions, Hyunjin and Jisung mainly, but I got Wendy and Solgi and Lee Tuck and, uh, it was, was all over the place. He potentially did something. <laughs> I, just, I think I got somebody from Pentagon, but honestly, they were just trying their best not to interact. <laughs> you know, doesn't didn't want to look at anybody. No. That, and then Why? he did Wusuk. He just kind of just stared out and just smiled. He didn't do anything. <laughs> he said to Wusuk, and I was like, great, yeah, we're was like, <laughs> Those two are like, eh, but, we're here. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's all that happened before. For the concert. Oh, we got a whole lovely grace. But and a whole basketball player. I obviously, player. I can go more Wait, in what? depth, but I'm not going to. <laughs> okay, anyway, um, well, we... Uh, stayed together for most of the day, so I guess I'll just say, uh, Jacob and I had to wake up at, like, 6 in the morning because we had to go pick up our, uh, wristbands for P1GA, and oh, man, that was fun. Not. <laughs> yeah, I woke up at 5.45 in the morning. To do your makeup. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't know you wanted to come with us. Anyway, uh, <sighs> so once we got that, uh, we came back here, picked up, uh, Cooper and, um, Nate, then... We drove there, parked, uh, what's the first thing that we did besides, like, what did we do first? Oh, we got our tick, we got our, yeah, we got the, we, we, we got had, our bands. We, we had, we, yeah, we had then to wait. We, we did the Ryan John. Yeah, we went to Ryan John's panel, panel. panel. I got to ask him a question about, like, expanding into, like, foreign music territory, and he just said a lot about it. He did, apparently he, he writes music for, uh, Idol Producer, mm -hmm. and he started, well, he's, he, yeah. I mean, he wrote pro uh, music for both Produce One Ones before it. So. It's funny how he did Idol Producer, surprising. but he didn't. I, did he write? He didn't do like Produce One One China, did he? I don't know. I don't he, think so. No. Yeah, that's funny. Um, See, so yeah, I got to ask him a question. Like he was, he was pretty cool. Um, we got, and then we got, after that was the. Uh, 
Esna panel, which it was, was am- incredible. Yeah, yeah, that was amazing. Like, because she showed us a bunch of uh, like demos, demos. And stuff that like I don't think we're on the internet yet. Uh, a couple of them Some she said were. Some but uh, yeah, like she showed us like Piano Man. Um, a couple other songs and yeah, like it was fantastic. Yeah, she was doing yeah. the demo vocals of for like Mama Moo or for whatever, yeah, she, whatever group. She writes for Mama Moo and she reminds me so much of them in general. Like she definitely, yeah, she's, she's, yeah. She, she, yeah. yeah, she's a good pair. I mean, she's hey, really, that's how she's really soulful. So. That's how romance started. Romance, they originally were writing. They're they're all songwriters for other people, and they, they just uh, decided to make a group out of it. Um, before I forget, actually, going back to Ryan Jun, um, we have like some breaking like revelations or whatever, where apparently. Love Bug by G Friend, which was a B side track on their most recent album. Uh, mm-hmm. That was originally a Twice song, yep. and that's a thing. Uh, mm-hmm. Also, uh, Four Walls origi- was a shiny song, and View was, was a- an FX song. So yeah, just like all of these, it's interesting how like a bunch of these songs were just sort of swapped between between I groups. I think that worked out well. Yeah, I think that, <laughs> I, I can't. I cannot imagine to try and try- View as an FX song. Does not no. sound right. No, I think it would still be really good. I don't know. I'd be interested. Still be doing stuff right now. I mean, I don't we think it'd be the exact then. same song anyway. Trigger. Yeah, but no, but like we were just talking about like how we want to see those versions like out in the yeah. wild. Oh somewhere. yeah, for oh, sure. That'd be cool. Um, uh, what else did we do? Oh, we hung out with Victoria. Yeah. The whole time. Hi, Victoria. Basically, <laughs> we're dead right now. Yeah. Oh. We're tired. Oh, 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 oh yeah, I recorded. Um, we got cheesesteaks. PD's high touch. Oh yeah, because you, you, yeah, you met PD, right? Yeah, I met him and we talked a little bit and I talked about Woojin and then we walked away and then while waiting in line for the concert, he yelled my name from like across the other way. Started hey. talking to Kevin about me and like everyone looked my way and I just I was swaying and a whole bunch of waving, just swaying back and forth. <laughs> but yeah, and finally I met him. So did you know? Did you were staying with us? I told him right away. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like so that when I recorded, I had to. He would like know that like I had I if I didn't see him I he knew I would have had a way to give it to him and yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. okay yeah. that works and yeah we uh, they Umu and PD did a, and Kevin did a meet and greet and we kind of just hung out there with yeah them. we yeah. crashed the meet and greet basically <laughs> even though we're not famous I mean, we were the first ones there so yeah we were the first yeah, yeah. ones there but we uh, we didn't take any we pictures we helped find Kevin cause we helped find Kevin because yeah and I sweeted him alone <laughs> oh and then Umu lost her phone yeah, oh that sucks. Yeah, she lost her phone in the one of the panel yeah. rooms in like early in the morning, and then yeah, she didn't have a find my iPhone. So Did she find it? No, she didn't. She didn't. Have, she didn't have find my iPhone. So she it, didn't have her phone for the concert. Yeah. yeah, I think it's gone. Basically, I don't know. Maybe by the time this goes up, the lost and found that then gave it to. Yeah, I feel bad for Umu. So if you have Umu's phone, please <laughs> let us know. Um, or Nobody tweet has. tweet at Umu. <laughs> Listening to this. I don't know. Uh, anyway, uh, let's get the actual concert now, since that's yes. kind of the bulk of what we want to talk to. I I kind of wanted to cover the like opening. I was really people. surprised by the order. The order? Actually, yeah, I figured I, they'd go this right. This was posted. That was what they posted. No, it isn't. No, 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 no. They no, never posted they in Hayes. order. They had said they wrote like. Hayes, Pentagon, Red Velvet. No, it's it's that oh, they they just they just list that as like whatever. Yeah, they do. They, yeah. Because I mean, if you remember last year, it wasn't in that order as well. Yeah. So they usually go just by like age order in such a way, or like yeah. who debuted yeah. first. Um. So, uh, there was a pre-show or like a, like I guess it's kind of like an opening act with uh the first is Jun Kodian, a fellow YouTuber. Uh, yeah. He did a violin cover of Bad Boy, and then he did a actually his own song. Yeah, he did his own song, which I believe we covered on releases list. Yeah, which yes. by the way, two of the dancers are Ellen and Brian, and they're amazing. And I, 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 I I've heard of Ellen. I don't know the other two, but Ellen she, and Brian were two of the dancers. She? I, she, she was definitely there last there year. Was one of them there was, was Corey. Yeah, yeah, I know who they were. She won, she won the dance. I don't know their names year. though. One of them is. Yeah, they won the dance. Though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, she, she won. Yeah, she remember the dance. Well, Ellen, Ellen, yeah, yeah, Ellen did. Yeah, she won it. Oh, I guess Cooper, you were there. Okay, yeah, so, okay. my heart yeah, out for Ellen. Yeah, yeah, Cooper, you were there, obviously. But oh yeah, that's right. I wasn't there. Um. So yeah, I actually enjoyed it. Um. And then after that, Ezna actually got to perform a medley of her songs. Yeah. Surprisingly of, good. Uh, oh, oops, she did. Ah, shit. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Which is funny. Um, amazing. Yeah. How is she only 30? Or how is she 30? Well, she like only 30. How is she 30 you? and, like, she looks oh, like... Sorry. She looks like the same age as Mama Asian, Moon people. Asian jeans. Yeah, Asian, Asian she jeans. She looks like she could be a member of Mama Moon. Yeah, basically, That's right? That's all I was thinking when she was singing. All right, so, uh... The concert started off... The actual concert started off with... I guess it was just kind of like a 
Super Junior number, technically. Yeah, it was, yeah. it was just oh, like yeah, an yeah, intro. Yeah. Sorry, it was sorry. just an intro for well, Siwon. The, the DJ. The DJ. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Gingel yeah. Gingel from yeah, Tracks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, yeah. Tracks. He, he was good. He, he, he loves the attention. He went off at Club KCON for forever. Oh, yeah. He, he went just, off today. <laughs> he did the Exodium thing at Club KCON, too. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, yeah, that, that was pretty cool. There was a pretty cool remix of Super Duper, which I'm kind of sad they didn't end up... It was Super Duper mixed with oh, Mr. Simple. Mr. Yeah. Simple. Yeah, yeah that was, was awesome. awesome. And then they just did, like... Part of like sorry sorry yeah and then they were like we're done for us. That was the what do you think of that? Like, that was weird, right? Like I was like, like oh yeah, yeah it was it was, it was super an, junior. I was like yeah, I I was really confused for a second, but it was just an intro because she one was hosting. Yeah yeah. Um, Cause Dude, it, yeah, because he was the five of them. Yeah, because he wasn't, wasn't in it. There, and yeah. We were like, where is he? Yeah. And then we were like, so oh, that's, my that's God, why I knew it wasn't them actually performing. Yeah, but I was just so confused as why they like did like part of the song and then just started walking back. But they were just getting you hype. Yeah, I think ultimately, oh, super ultimately in, le- in retrospect, I feel like the or this concert was more cohesive than it was last year. Yeah, for sure. For like, sure. if last year felt, but they they, they kind of talked too much, maybe. Yeah, yeah there was yeah. way too much talking. Yeah, it's like, also an hour longer. This yeah. this was yeah. yeah it's supposed to end at nine thirty it ended at ten thirty oh what? I didn't realize because because it fell so much shorter yeah it fell yeah. way because yeah I guess it's, now they think, had the same thing last year and I'm like they better do that for us considering we have five acts each night yeah because you, th- you normally you think with five acts do they only they'd have to cut down the songs maybe yeah. but I'm surprised that they actually would extend it like that yeah because I was I was really, I'm hoping tomorrow. But, but they had high expectations. Like, the Golden Child, Stray Kids, and Pentagon videos oh, that yeah. played before the thing. Like, no recording. No recording. Uh, no no over, recording. Like, there was, like, yeah, no was over-cheering. The people make were like, sure you don't, don't get a phone call. Make sure you don't get a phone call during the thing, because it might just yeah, turn you around you. Yeah, because people could totally hear that. Yeah, well, because <laughs> totally didn't answer a call from my Hello. mom. <laughs> but it's okay. They were hilarious, hilarious in those videos that they actually Yeah, no. Up. Stray Kids. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was like, funny. Like, oh, hold on. I hear my Seeing them on over Stray Kids. James, you're freaking out. Oh, God. To no themselves. Saying, no uh, okay, so yeah, after that, um, we go through a bit of an intro, and then the first proper act that went on was Stray Kids. Not yeah. surprising, because I feel they 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 were the newest oh, boy. <laughs> of those that were there to, yeah, here today. Right? They were in order too for the for the engagements. They were in order with it before. Oh, okay, that makes sense. So uh, think about that tomorrow if you get these first. I'm out. I can't. That would be insane. Oh my god. Uh, so it can't be real. Close. Uh, so yeah, thoughts on Stray Kids? I mean, I know uh, Nate, uh, Nate definitely yeah. wants to get to it. Well, no, yeah, it was just, it was exactly what I hoped it would be. I mean, they killed it. They're super hype. Really hype. Um, they're singing live as they always do. As they like, always, every time, yeah, every time they breathe, they do. Yeah, basically you could hear, uh, breathing. After, after this song was ended, you could just, all you could hear was like, <gasps> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh like God, really I loud. Know. I was like, yo, how do you do live time. vocals with, how do you do clean Live vocals. She's song with does that. not have his voice does not move. Crack or anything. And he's a rapper. Up, yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. That was the pro- That was the only yeah, problem that, with Stray Kids. There was a lot of I technical problems. Changbin's singing his, voice was sturdy too. Yeah, his voice, like his mic had problems. Felix's mic had problems. Yep. But I mean, no, we didn't even talk about the cool ass intro that oh, they yeah, did. The intro, I feel yeah, like the yeah, intro like set the bar. We didn't even have our banner thing. Yeah. Because uh, uh, you guys were sitting in the section where like they were they were coming down right so yeah. I was like I was like I, I I just saw a bunch of people like, be, like turn around and be like what the heck and I was like oh, oh he's we knew it was happening well, well yeah us. they're gonna come no, down no because when way. we got there we we went we down met a girl the thing and, and I th- I saw the Stray Kids thing on the scene I was like oh someone's doing a fan project so I picked it up and the first thing that I hear was a girl that turned to me and she's like Stray Kids are gonna be walking up this aisle the staff told us and I'm like. <laughs> Oh, man. Are you sure? I only put it on like the first two or three seats. And no, I saw people were stealing like the yeah. the banner because like they had, the the banners are only a lot along like one of the aisles, so it's, it was kind of obvious. Like I didn't know what it was at first. I thought it was just like like reserved seating or something. But yeah, yeah I saw people like going over and taking it and everything. Yeah, when so. she was hosting during talking, I don't know what what feeling I have, but I had a gut feeling. So I turned around and like I see the curtains yep, or whatever, just, and then suddenly I see like someone in a white hat and a white shirt, I'm and like, like kind of coming from the the right side and then they, they come into view and I'm like oh and I'm the only one turned around at this point and no, I'm the I only one who sees him first I looked around and I'm like oh, no, I saw him before he even became that's in a view that ass outfit and I'm like who's this guy <laughs> and I'm he, like, looks like, oh. he looks like a K-pop star I literally <laughs> started oh, screaming oh my god oh my god and, and then everyone was, slowly turns around she like, too. when she was talking uh, he was standing there he was just standing there I'm just chilling no one touched him no one attacked him or anything he was just there unbothered 
No, people are everyone knew. Oh, everyone did already. And okay. I turned to him and I, the, like, it got, it was kind of quiet. So I said, like, oh my God, I can't believe this is real. And he kind of, like, understood because, like, he turned down to me and he was like, and it was just, it was kind of like a moment. And then when their thing actually started, they did the Three Ratchet song with Ji Sung Chan and him. And like, oh, so the, is that like a concert intro that they do? or? Nah, Trisika, it's the Racha song. Oh, so. Okay, so. It's the three Coop, of them. Speaking yeah, of. It's, it's before Strike is, that's what they did. Oh, okay, that, like that the, makes sense. They have a bunch of songs. But. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. I, I feel like with Stray Kids, the the level of talent, not just in the production of their songs, the choreography, but and also like, I guess the presentation of it, I feel like it really came yeah. through in. Way better in just like seeing them live mm. than it does just even like a music video. Cooper, just, um, what are your thoughts? Because I know you really love Stray Kids, so. I do. Yeah, I was. I watched your show. I've seen the performances, but seeing them live. So different. I don't think there's any like competition. Yeah, again, it was crazy. Especially since they're ni- 90 days, three months since debut. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, their hundred days starts tomorrow. Oh their hundred day God. countdown starts tomorrow for like. like I can't even imagine what they'll like, be able to do in like. Uh, no, they're they're, yeah. they're thousand days. Their like, countdown tomorrow starts for like the hundred days with Stray Kids countdown for debut. That's insane. And I have to. I was. Gonna, and like it's not ten like, days. Ten days. Cause, hundred. Because usually when it comes to. Uh, when it comes to new group, new group groups that show up to KCON, there's usually like a. Nobody ever. Well, I mean, there's usually well, no. Usually, there's like such a like, uh, I guess a like a huge like rift in talent or like I guess stage presence when it comes to yeah, like the 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 veterans like like CN Blue or Super Junior and then like the new the new goose. But yeah, the, again, I, I f- they they were very they they oh, seem yeah. they seem like no, they didn't um, do it for years. Yeah, they yeah, they can't seem like they're pros like for real. Oh my like, god, I was I was really surprised by that actually. I need to watch the show. I wasn't. I knew they were going to be amazing. <laughs> yeah. I was so ready for it. Like, well, I, I knew their music was really ni- really hype. Like, I knew they, they were, were way better live. live than yeah, I, I, they I, don't I, stutter live. They're yeah. the, they don't mess around. Like, and just the, the revelation that it was live vocals the entire time is just... This is why they're my ultimate group. Yeah, so. I feel like this... The, the, like, that's sending a message, basically, to a bunch of other groups that they can do that intensive choreography, oh keep stable vocals, and not, like, have to, like, rely on backing They're going to be tracks. huge. And the kids are, like, jung in the kids. jung in and, like... I mean, they're, they're, th- they're gonna th- grow up to be like legit. Like they're yeah. gonna. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that's the thing though. Like you have to think they're only going to get better. Like once more experience, and they can crazy. write their own music and everything. So it's it's gonna oh. be insane. God. All right. So after that, uh, we uh, came back to more, yes. I guess, chill music with Haze. Oh yes. I, I loved how they didn't like. It was just like instantly into like the In transitions the haze, between. Yeah, because the, the, yeah, yeah, they get. It feels like they, again. Last year there was so much there was wasted so time. So much extra video that they just put up on the screen that we didn't need to see. Last and year. And then someone yeah. showed up. Yeah, last year. Yeah. Yeah, and then this year. And this year, I love how I get. I, I feel like having more artists per day is what made them like be more concise with well, time. Well, last year day one was five. Also. That's true. Yeah. That's true. Um. So yeah, Haze, like amazing. Obviously. Yeah, her vocals were flawless. Oh Again, my gosh, not more she's so vocals. talented. She's just she's so sweet. She, and she's beautiful. She's yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. She's adorable. Just mid singing, then she goes. She's like, somebody. Oh. <laughs> it was so cute. Oh. And it's funny how um, the the number one voted song on M Wave was uh, yeah, uh, Angel in July. Oh, just like, I was just like, wait, where's Dean? Where's like yeah. the actual? Like, well, every part of theirs, the said, guys around start singing. Yeah, basically. She said that she was surprised that was the number one song. I mean, I, I, that's, that's, not, that's not surprising. It's probably because it's, it's not as uh, popular in Korea. Yeah, I was gonna say it, that's her. But most of the international fans. Yeah, song yeah, because yeah, 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 definitely. Because exactly. if you've noticed in her recent albums or recent music, she's done more ballad. Yeah, stuff. more ballad yeah. stuff, which is good. But yeah, she hasn't really gone back to something. Like in 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 July or, um, Seven group. yeah, so yeah that that that, that was awesome. She's I got very a, humble. I love. Her. Yeah, yeah, I got a great picture of her, uh, her like with um, God, what was the song that she was singing? Star. Uh, yeah, probably Star. It was Star. Yeah, it was Star. And basically, just everyone turned on like their phone lights, and it's just like a beautiful picture of just her sitting like there, standing in the middle of the stage, just like all like the lights in the background. I'll link it definitely. Yeah, uh, a lot of things were happening around us when Star was performing, <sighs> like being performed. And I was really upset about it. Yeah. Just, I, I, I people, yeah, you said people were talking during Haze. And yep. Aubrey had to go get a staff. I, there was these. Pe- there were I two people up. in front of me that uh, 
their mother or something was the row in front of them a seat over but she kept coming up and having people sitting on her lap so it was like three people in two seats and it yes. was it was being it non-stop so I had to go mm. sadly miss some of that to go let staff know yeah, I think yeah. That, that's that's kind of the thing I'm afraid of when it comes to KCON sometimes because like as much as we want like these artists like Hayes or Super Junior or I don't know last year like CN Blue or whatever mm. uh a lot of the people that are just just there for yeah. like the most popular ones, they're not gonna give a shit. Yeah, yeah. It's a it's a I love it though because for every time they, these groups that you're talking about, I yeah. don't really know much of them at all before KCON, and when they get announced, I learn about them. Yeah, and, same. And I stand them afterwards. From Miss Nine, but yeah. not, they're not big. But <laughs> yeah, for me, a uh, temporary group. So. For me, I have seven, the same seven problem. Years. Basically, <laughs> wait, seven years. Seven they have years. a seven-year yeah. contract. Yeah. I didn't know that. It's M net because they were all. None of them were actually like doing under anything. companies. Mm. That was the whole point. Except for the. Or I mean, they were all like. What is, all, so uh, if the one who's in? The, yeah, that was. Gary. Yeah. Who's in Pro- Produce Gary, 48? Gary, Gary. Yeah, she, if she makes it to Produce 48, she's going to be in two but different... But when she comes back, she'll have she'll a lot more... And actually, you know, which is why it's going to be from his... There's going to be eight members of From His. Yeah. Not yeah, yeah. Eight. Eight. From His 8. It's a subunit. <laughs> anyway. From His 8. <laughs> so, yeah, that's day two. Oh, uh, yeah, that's day two. Oh, yeah. Okay, after Hayes, we got our first... Uh, the one thing I love about KCON is our... the. It's basically... It's it's, 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 it's it's M countdown. Yeah, yeah. So and then Pentagon. Yeah, basically they they do a lot of uh, special stages, and this special stage was who? who I guess. Oh, yeah, 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 and um, yeah, song. Yeah, song. Okay, so and they did. Uh, what was the song called? I don't know what they did. Uh, it's probably an SM Town. I can't. Honestly. I can't. Darling, you. Darling, 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 we, we, we covered it on releases list. Yeah, yeah they did. They. I remember they had. A, yeah, it was a song that they did together or whatever. Possibly for station. I think it was uh, for st- I think uh, it was for yeah, station. It, might have been. it had a oh, similar a music video to what they showed on the picture. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So that was, I mean, if I recall correctly, yeah. of all the you collaborations, know, there was though. problems because there was people in the bottom. I kind of lost focus halfway through oh. the performance. Oh, I know. Oh, I, no, I, I couldn't for focus on it because my like, I was trying to record it. Like that's my phone. when Felix and John mm. were in the bottom. Yeah, that's yeah. why I lost focus oh. too. I was paying attention because it was so oh, yes, Sulgi. Oh man, that's that's yeah. awesome. We got to see her do a du- duet, but I f- yeah. I kind of wish it was a. It wasn't just like a SM Station song. It was like a like a different like. Cause you yeah. know how last year they did like Beauty and the Beast. Yeah, they had actual like other covers. It and also everything. would have been yeah. nice if you would have been able to actually see them on the screens then, and they didn't put up just yeah. That, like, oh. You can see them on the thing. front ones, but on the big ones up above us, they didn't have. I mean, yeah. I was, I was, like we were right in yep. front because we had GA. So yeah. or Cooper and I had. I couldn't or, see or, the like, screens up above. Jacob and I had GA, so we. Were in like the pit, so we could just see them up front. Um, so yeah, that was that, that was a pretty cool special stage. After that was uh, Pentagon. yeah, Pentagon. Again, uh, I feel like I have a confession to make when it comes to the Pentagon because we, I think I, I none of us ended up picking Shine for a release list. I believe. Yeah. We cause... all skipped it. Yeah, it, well, because I only listened to it once, because I it's it's really quick, but like, as we've been hearing it over and over, it's da, like da, an earworm. Da, 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 it's like an earworm in your head. So like yeah, I that, no. that 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 I think that might be the biggest mistake I've made this year. And honestly, yeah. Shrine might be one of the best like top ten tracks. Oh, definitely. Oh yeah. my god! Like I feel um, like I, th- I think we definitely just overlooked it. Yeah, I guess it was we were just busy, but I feel oh, like, yeah. everyone overlooked it. It took what, a month for people what to they care. Did, what they did was Shine the first part of it before they actually did the cover. The like dance they, break. Up. No, it was when when. Uh, Edom went to the front stage by himself. Oh, with before. the, oh, the he did yes. that. The, the instrumental drumstick. was intense. Yeah, like because they because like there's like a like like a piano instrumental. I, and everything. that that riff I feel like is iconic. Like I feel like that's something that's going to like oh, stick around. It's, it's so stuck simple. in my. I yeah. can't get it out of my head. Like I keep saying da 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 like the entire <laughs> day. <laughs> I hate it, but I love it at the same time. And I feel like the reason why I wasn't so much into it before was because I, I wasn't into. Um, like Pentagon's previous songs because yeah. I felt like they were too try hard but this is so fun like this. and the choreography again is just so addicting like like, like the yeah, stadium yeah, the... yeah it's so like it, it's basically like nine yeah, hours just I, they have a really <sighs> catchy like one like, like I looked I looked thing. over to uh, during that song I looked over to where Kevin and Uma were sitting and Kevin was doing the choreo oh like, yeah Kevin um <laughs> from React to the K just the entire time was just dancing it was so funny I put like I, yeah, I'm, we, I'm we checking, put a clip on Twitter. I'm checking my out. notifications right now, and I think Jeff Benjamin just retweeted it or something like that. Not even joking. Oh, goodness. I don't know what happened, but anyway, I'll, I'll, we'll figure that out later. So, I'll, I, I was, I guess I, 
if I knew more of Pentagon's music, I think I'd probably enjoy it more. But I feel like, yeah, de uh, Shine definitely set the tone for it. And, oh, wow, that's, seeing that live was just complete. Yeah. I think that's that that's my that's my NCT 127 come to Jesus moment yeah, for this yeah. year, basically. Like, I've just been sleeping. on Because, I, I, again, we've talked about how, like, we kind of don't like Edon's voice. Because yeah. it kind of sounds like... Well, for me, it sounds like GD a lot, but, like, higher. It's weird. Or it's just like Sometimes, him, yeah. But, it's just yeah. like him trying to imitate GD in a way. But I mean, it didn't. It wasn't obnoxious on this song. I I think so. Yeah, I I thought no. I think trying it's really, it's really good. Um, uh, one thing, other thing with Pentagon is like I didn't know what songs they were gonna perform, so I picked the top four on iTunes. Yeah, they same, only they a, only performed oops. Shine. The other three were like like no. this should have been performed. Yeah. So we sign out should have been surfaced. Good for again. I know you're a big fan of Pentagon, so everything you hoped for. No. <laughs> no. No. What, what were you expecting? I wanted like this or Runaway or runaway Critical was, Beauty. Yeah, Runaway was they did that during Club Cake. Club Cake. Oh, so that's because yeah, they. Oh. But Critical Beauty, we really did. But District Nine and Elevator were also invented at Club Cake on. Oh, so then. But they did Girl. But both. Shine and Girl. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, like, like Gorilla was well done again. Like, that's that's the I think that's the, the only other Pentagon song they I did like. Can you feel it? And I wanted I screamed. Can you feel it? Then they did Pretty Pretty. Pretty Pretty. Oh my pretty god. Nice. There's yeah, somebody next to me who like freaked out over Pretty Pretty. He's like, oh, this is the only Pentagon song we know. It's insane. <laughs> <laughs> but I love it. Is that the only Pentagon song you know? What? I don't know. I don't even know. Shine? They had a music video for it. Okay. Yeah, it's it's with Shanghai. Shanghai's in it. Yeah, Shanghai's in it. Oh, that'll do it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I I remember she was in one. Yeah. But yeah, but Edon's intro was probably in my top five. Oh, with the with the he just had like he had a random drumstick and he was going of a night. Yeah, he was conducting. I feel like he always does it with something different every performance. Like oh, sometimes really? it's a keyboard. Oh God, yeah. it is. I feel I feel like the intros show. this year were so much better because sometimes yeah. sometimes it's, it's literally like. Well, at KCON, it's usually they just play intro music and it's just them walking to the stage. But they actually got creative with it, where like st straight kids like came three Rasha, there's yeah, like some in a group before their debut. Yeah. like that's insane. And then Hayes had like a really nice like nice video yeah, and everything. Was, yeah. Like yeah, I was just like wondering like because I saw on Hayes' Instagram, oh she's on the Brooklyn Bridge. Turns out she was filming yeah. her intro video the entire time. Oh. Yeah, that's huh. that was pretty cool. Yeah, I, yeah, I didn't. Know that. that was really cool. <laughs> I saw her Instagram picture, but yeah. And then like again with uh, the Pentagon, like the orchestration intro again. I feel like it. It feels like a lot more thought went into, because if you normally KCON just feels like uh, it's just like everyone just like here together, but it feels like this was more cohesive of a concert. Really put a lot more thought into like organizing it. I feel like it. they yeah. genuinely were sick of hearing how much people complained that New York doesn't get anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, 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 yeah. They, they, I feel like they, changed, they, they gave us that screen in the song. Yeah. Yeah. Before I came to KCON, I kept saying the Aubrey and everything, they constantly are changing it for the worst. Constantly getting worse. Things are getting worse, but it, it ended amazing. up being an Way amazing better, day yeah. and I was yeah. so surprised. Yeah. Like I, Everything went well for like me. At, at this point, like we're kind of jaded when it comes to KCON to some degree, but yeah, I, I, again, well, I said this on the... I We put up a tweet, but... I basically said like this might be the this this one day might be the best day of KCON yes. I've seen ever and I've 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 been in Os uh t 2016 when like BTS, BTS came and everything we came and like Mama Moo and all that sort of stuff so like for me to say that is saying a lot because there's a lot of groups so that have been, much happened and it was yeah I, I I love that they they put more attention to detail into making it a good concert and interacted with the crowd a lot more yeah because it's you, you I felt like before. They were like, okay, we don't want to give the girl groups as many songs, so we'll always yep. they'll just do the okay. We have we're doing a fun game, and then that replaces a song. Yep. Which I'm glad they didn't do with the with Red Velvet, with Red Velvet well, who was the next. They group they on gave this. them the game, but, but they, they still had four songs. The yeah, song, the song that they named the game after did Russia. not yeah, happen. Okay, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that was Russian. Yeah, yeah, yeah Russian I Roulette. Was I thought I could have sworn they were gonna go into Russian Roulette right. I was yeah. so ready for it, but they didn't do it. Yeah. Touch it. Only yeah. four songs they did. I mean, the, 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 that was I they did. Four they did the foreigner that I thought they would. They sure yeah, did. I mean, like, Pentagon do more songs than Red Velvet. Well, because they have. We'll get to that. The, we'll, we'll get to that later. But with Red Velvet again, <laughs> it's just another thing where they once Pentagon was done, bam! Like Sluggy just shows up and it's right into Bad Boy. Yeah. It's like there's there's no there was like no part of this concert where they gave you like any time to rest. <laughs> pretty much, yeah. it was just. It was not. Incredible. Yeah. Once once Stray Kids started, it was just like. 
constantly like with well that's music. the way we want it like yeah yeah, yeah, yeah non-stop exactly. that, yeah that's that's kind of like how you expect a concert of this magnitude it to be it helped build the hype so yeah definitely like, like just by the time Super Junior came out wow yeah, I was yeah. That's Everywhere. how you build a concert. Like, <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah, exactly. It was it was so well done. So yeah, with Red Velvet, obviously, I mean, we're we're all big fans of Red yeah. Velvet, so we enjoyed it. And I'd it was say, in English. Yeah, that's all I can say. That's all I can say. So uh, it started at Bad Boy. They do the first r- verse regularly. Well, first sold me as a dance break. Yeah, yeah. 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 Intro, a solo dance break yeah. for like a, using the Bad Boy intro, uh, just like longer. I can't um, wait till it goes into Bad Boy. I can't wait till Avnet releases like the official video. Yeah, I need to hear the audio. Yeah, Yuri. Yeah. Yuri started off the English, and that's yeah. when I looked at Aubrey. Yeah, I was like, yeah. whoa, 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 whoa. These are the lyrics. And then it stayed English for the rest yep. of the song. Yep. So good. Yeah, they so, did the it first. It was such. A, it was so good. They did the first verse and chorus in Korean, like the normal yeah. version, yep. and then and like now and there's gonna be a video without me screaming the lyrics in the back. English. Yeah, you know, it was which came out of nowhere and confused, broke everyone's yeah, brain. Yeah, because we, we all wanted to sing yeah. along. Like, yeah, wait, we, we don't, don't know the words to the no. song that's in our language. Think about it. Think about it. <laughs> My jaw was just dropped. Nobody yeah, knows the too. words to this. Yeah, we're the exactly. first no, people yeah. to ever, like, outside Every of SM. English, yeah. We're the first people to ever hear English lyrics to this song. We need yeah. to, like, start a Twitter, like, army of people to, uh, SM release studio version of Bad Boy English like, version now. Like, like, what, like what they did with Weezer and, uh, yeah, with, uh, Toto. Africa. Toto, Africa cover. <laughs> so, yeah, Ian, it's, it's cool how they treat KCON, like, sort of just like a, even though they're performing a lot of, like, older songs or songs that yeah, they're, yeah. like, mostly famous for their best hits, uh, I love when they do stuff like that just to make it interesting. And again, they're, they're catering, they're catering to their market. Do you see FTP? No, I said not Pentagon. Oh, not Pentagon? They did not do all... They did Shine. Everything else, there's so many other songs they could have done that are actually more well-known than what they did. Yeah. Mm. They did their early stuff. And, like, more... Because Gorilla and Can You Feel It, people were not feeling that concept. But once Like This started, the way that they were going with their vocals, that's when people started. Like This is when I got into it. Mm -hmm. See, uh... Cooper, I know you wanted to be down there, unfortunately. And I tried to take as many pictures of Irene for you, and... Uh, what were your thoughts, though? Yeah, I said this earlier, but... I was focused on Sulgi during the intro. I did not even notice... Oh, you didn't notice your body? group starting. You didn't, no- <laughs> you didn't notice your and ulti? I, and then I started screaming. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really go to that many concerts, so my screaming voice gave out, so I just sounded like some sort of dying <laughs> lake, lake monster. Uh, <laughs> lake monster, lake. that's a good one. Oh, like, man. My, my section, a lot of people sat, or uh, for like the whole thing. You were just like, oh, okay, come. So yeah, so I stood the entirety of Red Velvet. Oh, my God. And it was worth Oh, that's yeah. It was worth Even it. Even the awkward. Okay. Yeah. So they talked a lot more than yeah. anybody else. Well, they, did. Well, they, they, they have, have the actual game. game. Yeah, they have a game, and they have an English speaker in there. Yeah, the, the so game is at four. Yeah, <laughs> but the the game that the uh, Red Velvet played was just like the what? the what was it called, like the roulette later something <laughs> or whatever. And then yeah. it was like uh, Irene had to say "I love you" in like five different languages, yeah. and then what happened with that? Because I heard something about eight languages. Like, yeah, when no, like, like, when, when, yeah, 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 Wendy lost. said next time we should do eight. eight yeah, Wendy and then was Irene was extra. like, eight, "Why? What? No." Wendy was just being extra. Yeah, because <laughs> she knew that oh, Irene Wendy. barely could do five. Uh, and then uh, what was the last one she did? I didn't. Even, she had she an American song. song, American diva song. No, no, no. What was the last "I Love You"? I, I couldn't don't know. tell what I she said. I couldn't tell. I the, the, all, the other four were the obvious I, ones. I, I, I only, English, Korean, no, Japanese, I and Chinese. I, I was just was watching Thai. I think I heard something was it about Thai. Thai? Oh, yeah, that would make sense. Because, yeah, I had no idea. I, okay. I wouldn't know, but, um... What was that? Uh, yeah, what, what, what? Uh... Sulgi had to do a like, dance cover. No, uh, Sulgi had to co- yeah, do a dance cover. She did oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, yeah, she did sorry, sorry. Um, it was so perfect. And then... Yeah, we heard sorry, sorry like three times tonight. Uh, we totally not predictable that, that what was going to no. happen on that screen. Oh, you know, yeah. Was for yeah. was going to happen. Yeah, because no. they had the music ready. Like, yeah, they had the music um, set. No, she just pulled But no, yeah, they, they rehearsed that stuff. Uh, and then uh, Wendy had to sing uh, an American song. No. So yeah. she yeah. And she sang, obviously, New York City Mind by Alicia Keys slash... Jay Z. Yep. So, um, one thing I have to say though, again, I've it's it's on record that my bias is Solgi. However, I feel like Wendy kind of stole the show for me. Dude, Wendy's always been my bias. Uh, Wendy really did it like. 
She, it was so bad. She wrecked me so bad. She really jumped her way up. I really never, like, I like, looked at everybody in Revel, like, except for her. Or just, not just because, like, I never, she never stood out to me, but today she really, she really got me. Her outfit was amazing. She's, like, she's really, I forget she's the really brand kind. that she had on, but it was, like, crossed out, obviously, yeah. because I love that they still do that, because it's, yeah, that was hilarious. Because it's, like, it's, it's, it's on countdown, so yeah. they have to, but, oh, man, I'll Wendy. still buy a Siri, though, because she didn't, she was so quiet, but she was so cute. Wendy was always number two for me. But yeah, I, 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 Wendy's definitely. I think I, I think my bias first was Wendy, but then I was just I, before I really, really, really knew what like Red Velvet was. But then yeah, it just became Solgi. But I mean, Solgi was amazing too. The dance break, obviously. So for me, that was the best part of the concert, honestly. Even though I know you guys loved Super Junior a lot, but Dude, uh, um, well, just see, see, Red, Ve- Red Velvet was like very close. Yeah. But uh, if we go into I'll Super say, Junior, yeah, once I guess, we get into Super Junior, not being biased, later on in a second. My favorite, obviously. Uh, Super yeah. Junior was like a concert. Red Velvet yeah, was like well, performances. performances. Yeah, exactly. But, that, yeah, that was yeah, my description. I feel like yeah. the the revelation of there being English the lyrics. English version? Yeah, was, that blew yeah. my mind. I, I, that broke me. That broke me completely. All I can see was it was it was it's in fucking English. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, I also need I also need to mention when they did Peekaboo, it's like. It's just like all we were, I was behind them, so yeah. it, was all, it was all red velvet. Parts. Yeah, and I'm so just like, like uh, I'm okay with this. I'm just like I want <laughs> to put this up on the internet, but I'm not trying to put everything I have on our K-pop app. So, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, it was, again, it was nice that they actually went down to the lower area because last yeah, year yeah. Toys didn't do it at all. They only yeah, went to the middle. There was three stages last. Yeah, year. It was, yeah there was three. Yeah. It was like, there was the front not one, day not, one, the middle still. one, and then like there was the one closest to P two. Well, old P two back in the day. Yeah. And then there's, now there's only, they simplify the stage where there's only a front and then like the, the, the stage that juts out into the crowd. Which it's is like nice. Australia. Yeah, Don Hall was the only yeah, one dancer to go to Oh my god. He was, he was by himself. He was so. Yeah, I, I, I don't, I, I, I do like the, how every, I feel like they use the stage way better than they oh, had yeah. before. Oh, yeah. Because like there's more people that, like we were saying, like they, uh, Diamond and, uh, because I guess Diamond and Pearl, because I'm thinking of fucking Pokemon. Yeah. <laughs> Did you like that collaboration stage better than either of the individual performances? 
preferences or because uh, I know you love both groups, so yeah, this collaboration was really good. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, All right, they, they suit each other. Yeah, yeah, that's an awesome I'm collaboration. Sorry, I feel like they're really close already. Like, I love Strike is loves, yeah. yeah. loves that. Strike is loves Pentagon. And I'm glad that yeah. I love how, like JYP is a lot more open to collaborating yeah. with like, yeah. other. Yeah. Yeah. You're never gonna and then we got YG. You. So and they promoted at the same time with their with their voice like his debut song at Pentagon Shrine, so they were like always around each other. Okay, that's that's, that's, that's awesome. That's yeah. awesome that they were able to perform on the same night. Cause yeah. that, that seems yeah. like, like I didn't even think about it as a collaboration stage, but was, when I saw it, I was like, oh, that's a no brainer because they're, they're they, they work well together. So. They really like each other. <laughs> yes. Yeah, uh, Technically, numbers match up right now. Yeah. Too, yeah. Because, yeah. yeah. That yeah, that, that, that yeah, ended yeah. up working out in their favor. So now we get to the uh, main event of the show. Was which, that oh, was, the, was there not one of the Pentagon was missing? Yeah, I was gonna here. say like Yan's in China. Yeah. That makes yeah. a lot of sense He's for the choreo. Show. I was like, and Ming was also there, was, there was well, yeah, there was always they paired up every time, and there was always one person on. I was like, what is yeah. going on? I didn't you notice. didn't say anything okay. about it. Literally, okay. we get the Air Force photos of Pentagon coming and here, and then Yan is going the other way. Uh-huh. Like, okay, thanks, guys. <laughs> yep. So that leads into the last, the best Super the Junior. Last. Yeah, Super Junior. Seriously, like this uh, Super Junior portion is like a second gen sans, like complete dream. Like what dream? <laughs> yeah, you know, for real. Like, <laughs> I was completely floored. Like I was like, this can't be real life. Yeah. Like legitimately, but yeah. Super Junior was well, performing. And I thought I was kind of like, again, you, know, you guys are probably more experienced when it comes to Super Junior than I am because I just never got into them. Um, That's the second time I saw them. Oh, yeah, you saw me in Korea. All right, the only time I ever like paid attention to Super Junior was I think they were in a one, like one random LA like K-pop concert that they streamed on YouTube. Um, uh, anyway, I thought I was gonna be worried about how like Super Junior only has seven members now. Something yeah, like that. Yeah, six. Yeah. Who was missing? He he was oh yeah, he obviously. Uh, he just he was injured. So oh, it sucks again. He still not gonna be with his uh his students uh from his nine. So. Yes. It's so sad. Uh, but anyway, I was worried that with the last amount of members that they weren't going to be as hyped. Cause no, they were totally and, and also because with a lot, of, a, lot of, a lot of their songs were like a lot of the choreography was just intended for like like the massive. Like, yeah, all the, and they fixed that by adding the back. Yeah, that, that's, a, that's a perfect. I, I, that's a perfect solution. I mean, because Ram on stage a lot. The two yeah, that are yeah, in the military are two of the more calmer yeah. members. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the ones that we have here are the ones that way too much. You don't know, Dante came back and he was changed. Yeah, Dante, what? Yeah. Dante became a new person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The so they're, they might have they might changed. Yeah, <laughs> wait, the two what members? The two members that are in the military are very more calm. They're very 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 calm. But no, yeah, it was just insane how you play. You can tell, like, that's what you get for 13 years of experience. Yeah. Like, oh my yeah. god. They, they, they were just on a completely Their stage level. presence was just incredible. Again, they used, much like with CN Blue last year, yeah. they yeah. used every single inch of the stage. Yeah. Like, the far ends, the very like, close to us. Yeah. Like, we got, like, Itoko, it like, we got, he was, like, all the way in front of us, like, a lot of the time. Yeah. Um, Itoko was right in front of us. What? No, it was Who Long. Okay, he he walked. He went to the barricade and was like, "It was during miracle." I think Shindong took someone's camera or whatever. Oh, he did multiple he... times. Uh, Dong Hae also took a camera too. But Eunhyuk was like doing this thing where he would constantly run up and down the middle. Yeah. But it, there was one time where he ran with someone I don't remember who was down all the way to the end, and he was running so fast he literally reached the ex- tip of the end of the stage, and I thought, it was "Yeah." Fall off. <laughs> I got so scared. I was like, "Slow down." Have it. Same it's time. And no, and no, they, they started. Yeah, I was like, I, 
and she hugged everyone yep. leaving and like I'm she, still it, 19. So sweet. Yeah, I thought she, she called them boys. Yeah, she's like 19, I thought she was older than them. Yeah, I don't know. She called them boys. Like, yeah. yeah, like they're, like, they're younger. Like, than they actually yeah. uh, um, the day before KCon, they actually performed in uh, for our local news, local Fox yeah, yeah. Five channel, Good Good Day New York. Um, so yeah, it's it's awesome. It's awesome that they gave Leslie. Leslie like, Grace is 23. She also <laughs> came out of 23. Oh, oh, yeah. yes, 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 that's that's still that. younger. She's still younger. That's still younger. Good amount of age. Yeah, she was like 30 something. Yeah, yeah, yeah they're, they're all older. older. But I, I love how they gave her a chance to shine. She also came out on her own at the red carpet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, did she? Wait, yeah, did yeah, she? Yeah, she did. And she was really oh. sweet. And there's a basketball player too. I don't remember his name, but yeah, yeah. Oh, tell me. Also. That's weird. Okay. It's LeBron. Um, James. It's LeBron. LeBron's getting into cave off. But then yeah, they did basically. They did the actual songs, but they just ran them into each other. They mixed them together. Like I feel like they kind of did that because are, are they missing some vocal lines or like? I vocalists? think well, right yeah, now. Kujan, Kujan and, and Roa are both in Kevin. is yeah. very much holding the vocal line. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Jason, so he's the only. Yeah, he's not the only one. So they probably, yeah, I feel like yeah, they, they probably sort of like mashed the songs together and did more dance focus. Yeah, yeah they made the more dance focus. Yeah, because so yeah, I feel like it's more better. Oh my god. Yeah, he held one note for like 40, no, like 30 or 40. Oh my god. Oh, uh, they did. Bad. So they did. Sorry, sorry, obviously. Yep. Um, Mr. Simple. Yeah, Mr. Simple. Bonama. Uh, yeah, the yeah, rock, rock version of Bonama. Holy crap. Um, so wait, was, was that already released? Because I was like, whoa, is this like a remix that they're doing? That's like something they do at Comic Yeah, they okay. do. Yeah, yeah. I loved it. I like that um, That's like super old. I like that like DVD. Yeah. yeah. The actual song. No, yeah, the rock but, version's so good. Yeah, it's like stuff um, you only get on a DVD. And then, was there something else? They didn't do it on the Pizza or it's your devil. Was it Miracle Axe or they did? Yeah, yeah. I'm, oh, glad, yeah. I'm, glad, I'm glad it was. Oh my god, that's why 
last year, though. Yeah, I'm glad that they oh, that they still put like the the elders or like the, the things that. Because yeah. honestly, how many how many kids but, these days actually know who Super Junior is? Yeah, but apparently a lot more than we thought. Yeah, yeah, a lot more than we thought. Apparently, technically today is one along, which is not really an elder group, but. Yeah, I know they're gonna be. It's, a, it's, gonna be a it's just they're gonna be. Well, the end because yeah. they they make. Well, today is the mandatory M that day where you get promised one on one. Yeah. Like the groups you knew that were gonna be your guarantee. So I mean, I guess that wraps it up for the most part. Just yeah. like, overall, like we definitely best concert yeah. I've ever been to. Yeah, yeah. best concert easily. Best five I've ever. Yeah, this is easily one of the best days of my life. Yeah, this like, is easily one of the best way better than last easily. year for sure. It's probably the strangest, but like literally. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, as you were saying, it's, it's gonna be hard to. I'll say yeah, so tomorrow is gonna be. It's impossible. It's not. Tomorrow, it's so. not gonna be as good. But no, I'm ready for one on one. I'm excited. I want to see what they do for the ending. I want to see if they make it like type and different because it's technically a part of their tour. I'm just ready for energetic so. with one on one. Yeah, yeah, I'm just ready to see energetic. I know they did it last year at LA. I want to see they're gonna pull some random songs. Oh my gosh, if they do never. They, they're gonna pull some random songs. They have to do never. Like, I, I do. They have too many actual their own. Yeah, they have too many. They just have like. But the problem is too many of their own house tracks are garbage. So. I like boomerang. I like all of them. No, I, I like boomerang. Like no, I love boomerang. It's boomerang so bad, good. but I mean, I know they're gonna do it because it's the title track. So anyway, that's for tomorrow's video. Uh, we have to get some sleep. We have to wake up in like. It's two a.m. Yeah, we have to wake up in like four hours. So. Now. <sighs> it's two a.m. Uh, any closing <laughs> closing words? <laughs> anyone? Yeah. Sure. Right. Applebee's five dollars. Stand back on Santa Trek.